Hello guys, welcome to All Things Valuangila YouTube channel. We have something in store for you. We hope you enjoy. Hey guys, uh, welcome back to my YouTube channel. And as you can see, I still have my sister here. Ishakwa, our YouTube channel. So welcome back to All Things Wangilas. Mm -hmm. <laughs> And it's another episode of things we don't talk about. And today we are going to be talking about loss. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So we are talking about loss in a sense, in a sense of uh, losing a loved one. See loss, loss of a job, ama a relationship. Tunongia in a sense of losing a loved one, a friend who died mm -hmm. among a family member in that sense, someone that was really close to you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, kuna questions in your heart? Yeah, so, okay. Neza kuuliza or nimeuliza in return. So, in our case, okay, you can say in our case, we lost our dad. So, that's something we have in common. So, yeah. Uh, so, Ashen Ulise, what, who is the most important person that you have lost in your life? Mm, my dad. Mm. Mm. Me have two. Mm -hmm. I think my dad na having a miscarriage. I think it's something that people really don't talk about, literally. But losing a child, atakama it's a miscarriage that was three months, ama four months. It's a human being that was growing inside of you. Na uko na intention ya terminating the pregnancy. So, that really affected me as well. So, I'd say losing my dad and losing a pregnancy made them, them the hardest losses that I've ever had to deal with. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, and in the moment, what I what is the feeling? So, what was the feeling that I felt yeah. in the moment? Yeah. On the moment of the loss. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Niende first, I'm going to go first. Okay, you can go first. So, for me, Gledada uh, Ikufa, in the moment, I was numb. When, when I'm in shock, I usually am numb. I will I don't talk about it. I don't say anything about it. I don't cry. So that was the situation in the moment. But after ni may digest sasa. After digesting what's happening, then the other emotions zinaanza kukuja. But in the moment in the moment to me I'm I'm usually in shock. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, in my case, mm, that feeling in the moment was maybe, maybe see evil serious. Mm. No, no. Mm. It's not that serious. You, okay, I was a kid. You know, when you're a child, the most important things to you ni ukule, ulale, eh, mami, mami ako, mostly, na maybe daddy to provide so but when you're a kid how when you're providing aspect and you know not to mom na dad wa kwa pujui, mm. how they, how it works how it works so yeah. kwa hiyo uh, at the moment nili feel too maybe see was serious it's not that serious do you still have your friends there nini there no no as as much as you mtu amekufa watu wana mourn things bado zimeendelea so at the moment you really feel see big deal, see yeah. serious. Yeah, as in it's not even happening. Yeah. Mm. And you are you, you guys were mm -hmm. Yeah. But I was aware Lilikwan may lose an an important person. Uh, you know, I was aware. Ju the ju how close we were. Mm. Yeah. Uh, yeah, then the short term, short term journey to accept. Uh, what was the the you know, the short term journey? What was the experience of you accepting? So, sir, this person is not there anymore. 
kuna hiyo short term alafu kuna the long term sasa after years mm-hmm. Aki short guys <laughs> msi mind hiyo kuku imekataa kuenda mm. short term short term ni kama mm-hmm. like after months sasa amekufa one month two months mm-hmm. ime happen so kulikuaje for you okay ndi la jenayo eh okay talking from a person when you lose an important person as in a feel after it really hits you after wamezika huyo mtu na everyone is gone no no umebaki hapo ni wewe na mama yako na sisters zako no no join in, in african family like in with us we didn't really sit down na mom toka umeloose umeloose you have lost a dad yeah but in african families sioni kama kuna hiyo appoint mna have yani mzazi the remaining parent and a feel you are una experience your trauma unaona do everything in a change in an yeah. instant do in our case to remove head to move to a different place alafu eh uh, we at a school juli kuna napelekwa kwa shule mzuri yeah. now things zimeanza kuwa challenging financially yeah. yeah. inafaa u move to a different school, school. Yeah. so inafaa u adjust without that person so unaanza ku feel so me is i think the more nili as in after siku na feel acceptance nilikuwa na feel sasa hiyo grief after mm. yeah for me for me i think it 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 hit hard in case ya um, ya dad it hit hard after um, after burial saying everyone is gone now what next mm-hmm. yo so do unaanza ku feel impact ya this person not being around mm-hmm. like like you said i was i was also very close with dad na alikuwa kama a, a, a confident sasa you don't have that anymore like from a young age my mm-hmm. relationship with mom was ish ish it was mm-hmm. hard mm-hmm. so you don't have that confident you don't have someone to talk to you don't have someone mwenye umetamani kitu ondo mwambie he ni baie hii nimetamani mm-hmm. so kuna to that gap and it's very evident eh. na nakumbuka na i had to change school pia mimi i had to move from zoya to go to kolanya to kolanya girls I had to adapt to new people, mm-hmm. new friends. Mm-hmm. So nikiwa kolenya I was very a very dominant person. I wasn't at a square cha kokolanya. Ju sikwa I wasn't active in, in class, I wasn't active in sports. Nilikuwa ni I was just existing mm-hmm. your time that whole year. Mm-hmm. I was just existing. Do going to Bulimba had to repeat the same class ju. There's nothing I was doing that year. Nilikuwa mm-hmm. tu Mm-hmm. So yeah I think even though it was that hard mm-hmm. alafu not having like una feel ni kama you are lesser than other people watu wakianza kuongelea they are uh, dying especially especially unajua ukikuwa the, the more you grow I feel that maybe kikuwa now ka your your loss inge happen now mm. kuna your grace unge feel juu watu wana sympathize with yeah. you yeah. but at a young age no one cares no one really cares me lose sijui nani mm. no one really cares live in and live nyiko visiting mababa za watu wata, na pia wewe auko hiyo emotionally capable to handle hiyo sai ukiona baba ya mtu na ume lose baba it's okay it's okay mm-hmm. but ukiwa mdogo mbona wangu wa yuko mbona wangu wa yuko yeah. unataka mtu ana kuelezea but pia to get you especially sasa sisi who get you from the other parent the other parent and expect we so uliona wakizika <laughs> si unajua nini me happen so pia wewe mimi ni me lose husband au me lose baba kwa so kila mtu I've I stumbled through through like yeah, yeah. as in life and the life mm-hmm. yeah and mm-hmm. I think with with losing a pregnancy I think that is the hardest thing I had to deal with you I was grown nilikuwa mtu mkubwa your dad I was still young so processing it was kind of not the same alafu pia ni trauma ya kitambo si kama the other one mm-hmm. so with he 
kwanza kuna ile ile feeling ya tu ulifanya makosa bado uja get over it alafu kuna hiyo ya i have like the moment niliambiwa sorry you have lost your pregnancy i got numb nili feel numb then after hapo ndo nikaanza sasa ku process like it was so bad that siko nataka kusikia jeni ya kilia it was that bad juu nilikuwa na feel ni kama i felt a resentment and anger i was so bitter it got me so bitter nilikuwa so bitter at everyone even god mbona why did you take this away from me no no so dealing with it was so hard nika nika let go nikaanza tu ku also ku exist yeah so people really need to talk about miscarriages Mm-hmm. Ju nikaanza ku feel kama it was my fault what did i do wrong mm-hmm. what was i eating mm-hmm. maybe i was overthinking mm-hmm. no no mm-hmm. yeah mm-hmm. Uh, so what 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 is it like what was it like living with that person so in, in your case maybe dad living with that akiwa as in living without them oh. now that I think okay so it was hard but i think inafika time una una ini unafika place ya life lazima tu iendelee but uko nyuma it was hard to losing a father ni in a play ni is very significant to literally life will change kabisa especially kama he was the breadwinner so mama na father just bila atawalipia school fees ni wote bila atawa feed lafu nyi mnafaa mwa just bila you have to uh, you don't like amtapata everything that you want because you have this one person when you unategemea mm-hmm. so you have to accept what is there mm-hmm. so eh uh, so kukuja kwa kwa hiyo acceptance mm-hmm. it was a bit hard mm-hmm. Uh, your life you may change you don't have the things that you used to have anymore you can't go to the schools that you that you used to go you can't chase the dreams that yeah you, that you had yeah, as in dreams uh, in a feeling like kuna a part of your life una give una, up. yeah una you una chana up. nayo you start, you start looking for new dreams, dreams. Mm-hmm. new dreams new ambitions mm-hmm. and everything mm-hmm. yeah true mm-hmm. Ata friends mm-hmm. ata only friends when you ulikuwa now when your dad was there somehow they how fit your lifestyle yao uh, ama standard ya living yao mm-hmm. so you have to start looking for new friends mm-hmm. like life in a change completely mm-hmm. and i remember uh time dad alikufa mama ya DC she told me that unafujue from today your life is never going to be the same yeah and sikujua how important hiyo statement ilikuwa mm-hmm. until after mm-hmm. burial sasa tukaanza kuishi life ndo nikaanza nikaanza kuona he vitu change yeah. in a yeah. snap it's of never, a thing never the same in a snap of a thing now by the way no one cares no one hakuna mtu eh? that is the saddest the world the uncomfortable the, uncof- uh, the world moves on yeah the world moves on alafu it's very hard especially upate hauna supportive family in our case we didn't really have a supportive family especially from our dad ju kila mtu alikuwa tu ana go alafu pia cc as siblings uh-huh. we, we didn't use to talk about it uh-huh. everyone was just living dealing with it the uh-huh. way they know how kwa una deal nayo kivi yako mimi deal nayo kivi yangu kila mtu tu ana deal nayo kivi yake yake yeah of which is not right ni poa at least mkoe na you talk i think this is the first time we are literally talking about it in in yani for long yeah for long yeah yeah eh ju see it's not an easy conversation ju kuna zile triggers you feel once umeza However, hata kama imekuwa 20 years, mm. imekuwa 50 years. They're still your like, parent, uh, ama they're still your dad, ama your sibling. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, so living with the person it's been hard. Yeah. So nini pia eh pia hiyo nini case ya losing a child. Hiyo point yenu umesema no one cares. Mm. It hits home. <laughs> last year, last year I think I had nilikuwa na breakdown. 
nilikuwa na anxiety unakumbuka yote i had so, a very bad anxiety so um i was with nani kilimit na na the guy who got me pregnant so we were talking and i broke down like so hiyo ndio ilikuwa time yenye i was telling him how i really felt about the whole situation how it went down and how no one cares hakuna mtu anakuuliza how are you after hiyo ume lose mtoi life may move on no one talks about it ivo ndio nakumbuka there's kuna last last year ni Georgina G na yeye ndo they usually tell me happy mother's day like who wanna make effort ya kuniambia you still a mother so ni something that no one cares who may have miscarriage sawa maisha yendele so eh, i think ni something in you in your people closest to you mtu anafaa kukua kukua intentional na nini ku ku have ile empathy ni empathy mm-hmm. ya ku find out how the other person is doing how are you doing mm-hmm. after this and this has happened mm-hmm. how has it affected you like at least you make you to feel ni kama someone cares Yeah. Mm. But to say that you may people go through things mm-hmm. na they don't talk about them. Mm-hmm. What to anaendelea at life to mm-hmm. move on. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So kama a friend has lost a parent, I think it's important to check on them. Mm-hmm. We'll find out how are you doing? How is this affecting you? Ni ni important. Mm-hmm. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, how it changes your life. Hey. <laughs> well, hmm. it changes your life and in a, in a change your life in so many ways in kwanza hiyo a father figure ime watu wanaona kama a father figure is it a father figure especially father figure and watu wanaanza ku funny enough i don't know it. why but funny enough mtu anezaishi bila mama but bila baba inakuwa fact so much as much as mama ni important okay ukiuliza kila mtu between mom and na dad baba, kila mtu atasema mama mom, but uki usipokuwa na a father figure inaku it plays a, it big, plays role. a big role somehow yani nani parental role more than anything else true about parenting so uki lose your father figure hivyo alafu auna wale watu wako willing to step up for you maybe your uncles your nini like me in my case me hata say this mama hapa ni semeni kwa na father figure na juu there's no one who checks up on you unaendeleja mm, juu baba normally natakuuliza shule kukoje mm. nini unataka what, what are your dreams, dreams? Yeah. nini nini unaona mm. vitu hizo mama as long as ame provide ame kunacha ye ye hunacha but kuna zile vitu zile vitu important zako yani for you atakuwa very keen enough na mama ako ako she's willing to take the yani ako take back however broken however unsuccessful you are yeah, yeah. than true than a father a father ataku push unaona fathers wanakonga na ile tough love eh yeah. yeah while mothers yeye ni unconditional uh, yake ni unconditional uh, love she will take you as you, as are, you are with your brokenness with mm. your mistakes mm. with your everything mm. ukianguka okay, mtiani atasema mtoto wangu but baba atakwambia wewe wewe yeah, 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 na mm, mm, true true yeah. so hiyo part ina financially naona the things you ukizaliwa ukiona kwanza venye sisi tulikuwa tumezaliwa life tulikuwa tumeishi point tulikuwa tumefika before dada pass tulikuwa tumeona the struggle yeah. so unaona hiyo mnaanza ku catch up on life mnaona things zinaanza ku get better then shoot hizo vitu zote trash trash start a fresh start a fresh yeah so yeah inakuwa hard in in uh, as in in a change your life in so many ways so in affected it Okay yo ndio the next thing as in in affect the relationships zako na watu with the men with dating as in with adi trust issues adi we mwenyewe unajipata wewe ndio the problem juu sometimes see the other person eh yeah, alafu